public tax records are giving us some new insight now of an Overland Park Police charity. This is tied to a criminal investigation examining how the charity's former directors used those donations. KSHB 4119 reporter Jessica McMaster first broke that story at f that four police officers are on paid leave as part of this investigation. And now today Jessica has more details on the charity's expenses and why a charity watchdog group is giving that foundation a failing grade. Public tax records show Overland Park Police Officers Foundation received more than $1 million in donations from 2016 to 2019. Several people who ran the police charity tied to the local police union are under criminal investigation by the Johnson County District Attorney. The I-Team first broke this information Tuesday after multiple sources confirmed four members of the police department who once served as directors for the charity are now on paid leave. The most recent tax record available from 2019 shows the police charity collected $353,454,000 and spent $248,000 $435,000. It's not immediately known what time frame of spending is in question or how much of the money raised went to what. The foundation is supposed to bring in cash for families of fallen officers, injured officers, and for things like education and community outreach. The charity watchdog group Charity Navigator gives the police foundation a rating of 45 out of 100 points, a failing grade. The score is based off the foundation's 2019 tax records and is based off financial health and accountability. The president of the Fraternal Order of Police sent this statement to the I-Team Tuesday saying the union questioned the foundation about its spending a year ago. Once new directors took over the foundation, they ordered an audit of the finances, which are now with the DA, who will not comment on the case, citing the investigation. If you go to the foundation's website, this is what you'll see. It's now offline. Just hours after the I-Team initially began began looking into the allegations. The police union sent this email to its members stating it's suspending the foundation from new business. For the I-Team, I'm Jessica McMaster, KSHB 41 News.